So E3 tweeted this yesterday. Great list of games women gamers are playing. Any of your favorites make the cut. Oh boy. <laughs> women gamers, female gamers. What are these women playing? Cringe, cringe lord. We have an archive of the article. You guys want to know what women play? Have you guys been asking yourselves what women play? Have you been wondering? Because you're about to find out right here. I know you've been wondering. It's, it has been a highly kept secret. Gals love gaming just as much as men. According to a report by Entertainment Software Association, of the total 214 million players in the US, 41% are female. Blah, blah, blah. There are some games that female players tend to gravitate towards. So here we go. Sudoku. I play Sudoku on my phone. Does that mean I'm a girl gamer? Yeah, it does, actually. It, it does. Congratulations. You have earned your girl gamer card. But Loco, this was written by a woman gamer. Shouldn't that just mean all of this is totally fine? Friend Hammer, thank you for asking. No, it's not okay. Just because this was written by a, uh, a woman, um, women can be misogynistic as well. Women can have unfavorable and poor takes towards women. Believe it or not. Candy Crush. The women, they just can't stay away from the Candy Crush. We can't, we can't. I, I mean, who, who is, who is playing Candy? I'm playing Candy Crush right now. Honestly, I, where, where are my women? Who's playing Candy Crush right now? I know I am. I'm so hooked on it. Animal Crossing New Horizons. Every time you, you read the next thing, like just, just like ask yourself, why did E3 tweet this out? <laughs> Overwatch has become extremely popular with ladies who game. In fact, it reportedly has twice the number of women who play it versus any other first person shooter game. Women like it since it has a lot of female heroes to portray, giving them the chance to hold their own amidst the boys and for its fantasy elements. I'm surprised we didn't get um, any uh, any recommendations for classes? You know, I was hoping that they would, you know, at least let the women know that they can only play support classes because that would definitely uh, help further steer steer all these lost women in the right direction. Solitaire. <laughs> Solitaire, guys. Wow. Solitaire. Really? Really? Like, like, what? Why? Why is this a thing? Why? This, this article's getting so bad. It's getting worse. Why is Solitaire being recommended as a game that women play? Sometimes simple is best for those simple women minds. We gotta get down to the basics. The free game that comes with every PC. It's easy for women brains to figure it out. Our female users are surfing the web and see classic games as a quick and fun pit stop. Is this written by aliens? This, this like reads like it's written by aliens. Play for free at com. Play for free at com. Like, did someone write this with their face? Sims 4. Of course we play The Sims. Of course we play The Sims. The Sims where you can, you too can be a housewife virtually. Perfect. You can practice your cleaning skills. Stardew Valley, the jeweled classic. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. Am I right, ladies? <sighs> I've, I've, I've thought seven times of smashing my face on this keyboard, but my microphone's in the way. Bang Dream Girls Band Party. Bang Dream Girls Band Party. Casino World. Star Chef cooking game. Of course we play cooking games. That's all we freaking do is play cooking housewife simulation games. That's what we play, guys. You didn't know? We got to practice and hone our skills so that we can cook for you in the kitchen. After I'm done this stream, I got to put in my hours on Star Chef cooking game so that I can cook for the man in the house. Jesus, what would I do without Star Chef cooking game? I'd be so freaking lost. Who would I be? What worth would I have if I wasn't playing Star Chef cooking game? What, what would I do with my life? Who would I be? Heyday. Why are we... So we do farming too? Guys, you can dress up your farm with flowers and fences and trees and 
cute little birds and and like it's just so cute it's perfect for women because you know it's just flowers obviously flower kim kardashian hollywood adventure this is us guys this game allows players to join your favorite kardashian on a red carpet adventure create your own aspiring celebrity and rise to fame and fortune because th this is like what we all care about you can also choose your own look and style your character quote rule the red carpet travel the world and own exotic homes and pets who doesn't aspire to be a kardashian like look you get to have a baby and a husband like that's 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 the dream for any woman is just have a baby and husband harvest moon seed of memories okay so another farming life sim house flipper if you're a fan of anything on hgtv which i know is all you watch then this game might be your thing. You'd get to decorate. Woo! Disney Code Illusion. Who says coding is just for males? I don't know, chat. Who, who says that? Who says coding is just... Who does... Who says, <laughs> who says coding is just for males? Who? 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 Who says that? Who says that? Who says that? You're saying that this misogynistic piece of crap article. You are saying that you just said it. Woman can code too. I mean, you know, as long as you have some spare time, because at this point, I mean, you're probably busy doing a uh, cooking chef star simulator, whatever the hell that's called. You're probably too busy doing your cooking lessons in a game or playing Candy Crush for the, the simplistic color coded mind. But hey, if you've got a little room in that small brain of your yours, women, well, you can do this game. Disney Code Illusion may sound like it's for kids. Like, how demeaning is this to start off your paragraph by being like, "Who says coding is for males?" Oh, this looks like a kid game, but don't, but tell, but 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 let me tell you, this looks like a simple idiot kid game, but women play it too. The, the mature female brain is just, it's, it's a masterpiece. It's a marvel. And you can code with your favorite Disney princesses. The game of life. Oh my God. <laughs> I can't. The game of life. Like it's, <laughs> it takes me back to my childhood. And after all these years, it's still fun to get to, to put the blue and pink pegs in the car when you land on a space that says you have babies. <sighs> women should get into a relationship get married have kids and cook like that is literally the games that this this article is recommending like that's literally the all the games housewife it, these, these are housewife simulating games are you okay no i'm not okay when e3 promotes garbage like this i'm not okay okay there are already do you guys know how it, this article seems silly but do you know how harmful this is to women to perpetuate the stereotype that like we only play cutesy housewife simulator games? It's funny and, and, and I get it like uh, I'm sure a lot of guys are just like laughing this off like thinking like whatever but it actually like is so harmful. Like they should list all the like the most hardcore games because guess what? We play everything. We literally play the same freaking games you guys play. It's harder to to find us in the space, especially in multiplayer games. A lot of women don't like to use microphones for some good reason because there's still a lot of bullying. Gaming and nerd stuff is still considered a boys club and men see it as an invasion of their safe space and get really hostile about it. This article is just perpetuating this separate but equal definitions of gamers and girl gamers. Yes, couldn't have said it better myself, Lucky Drew. And yes, this article was written by a woman, a, a woman. And yes, like women can have misogynistic takes. They can have backwards uh, opinions on things. I mean, we just talked about this yesterday with women's suffrage. The 100th anniversary of women's suffrage, the right to vote in the US was contested by women. There were women who were against letting women vote it happened being a part of a group doesn't exclude you from being exclusionary towards a group e3 tweeted this and it, it did not go over so well for them and so the, anyways they did they they deleted the tweet and they said we messed up <laughs> we're taking down uh the post and apologize for perpetuating a harmful stereotype we will do better you know it's a real shame to see e3 get canceled twice in one year the, the second that you write women gamers you need to take this and punch yourself in the face okay i just so it's like the same thing with female streamers 
no one says male gamers like like replace anytime you write female anything replace it with male and think about how stupid you sound no one goes to tim the tatman and says hey you're my favorite male streamer they go hey you're my favorite streamer so when people come to my stream and they're like hey you're my favorite female streamer i'm like that is not a compliment <laughs> like you are you're literally segregating me and you're, you're just, like i'm not a female streamer i'm just a streamer like it sounds so stupid hey you're my favorite female streamer the favorite streamer of the female type because you don't show your breasts on stream like it's not it's like don't like don't don't do that like we're not like our own group that needs to be like put against each other i'm just a gamer i'm just a streamer i'm a human streamer <laughs> but yeah so e3 like you uh you done goofed